I always heard about the sound of rain. Something is moving in the forest. This is something a wolf can't ignore. The wolf is North America's most efficient hunter. Although it is not as big as a bear, male wolves only weigh up to 99 pounds or 45 kilograms, and females are slightly less. They hunt large prey such as moose in packs. And that's the secret of their success. <laughs> only one pair in the pack, the alpha pair, mates and all of the rest of the pack help raise the puppies. Wolves have a number of gestures and ways of greeting each other. These gestures help to solidify the pack. Play helps the young wolves develop the skills they need to hunt. But today, the moose is just a distraction. These wolves are well fed. There is a lot of danger in hunting a moose. And so the moose wanders off. And the wolf, after a brief playtime, goes back to sleep. Having been assured by the wolf's behavior that he's not in any trouble, this bull moose moves on. It is the fall. He has been rubbing his antlers against trees to get rid of the velvet that has covered them since they began to grow in April. It's tough on the trees. At first, the dead skin hangs from his antlers, but this will soon fall off. The fall is the rutting season, and moose are active. The large antlers of this bull indicates that it is a dominant male. Females assess the antlers and will select him to mate with over the smaller bulls. The size of a bull's antlers indicate its health and its age. The size of the antler tends to peak when the bull is about six or seven years old. It's in its prime. Moose with smaller antlers are either younger or have not been as successful in finding the food they need in the spring. The moose is a relatively new arrival to North America. It arrived here after the Ice Age from Eurasia. The bulls can weigh up to 700 kilograms, close to a ton, and the females can weigh up to 360 kilograms. Females do not have antlers. Moose prefer to live in forests. They do not live in herds. Moose is the Algonquin name for this animal. It means twig eater. In Europe, they are called elk. This cow is stripping the leaves off of a tree, but a change is coming. Fall will soon end, and then the hard times begin. So moose eat and eat to help prepare for winter. <laughs>